Everybody, I want to talk to you about the number one fear that holds people back from creating the life that you really want, the life that you wish was yours, the life you wish you were living. So the number one fear is hands down the opinions and ideas of others. And what's interesting about this, though, is that as we actually start to break it down, it's often not always necessarily the opinions and the ideas, but what we think their opinions and their ideas might be. So you want to get your business going, you want to get your life going, you have dreams you want to make happen, but then you have this fear or this reservation, sometimes it shows up as procrastination, sometimes it shows up as being a perfectionist, sometimes it shows up as ideas like I don't know enough or I don't know what to do or I don't know what the next step is and all these lies that our mind tells us to get us to not act out of the fear of what others may think, possibly think. And what's funny about it is we don't actually know what they're going to think. We don't actually know what their opinion is going to be. Sometimes you might because they've told you, but most of the time it's a projected, a made up fear of not even knowing what their opinion or idea might be, but thinking that they may have some kind of negative opinion or idea. And this holds us back from success more than anything else. So the key is that if we really want to truly create the lives that we desire to truly create the life that you want more than anything else, then we've got to overcome this fear. How do you overcome it as you start acting anyways? You start understanding that they may think that, they may not, but whatever they think is up to them. You can't control their opinion. You can't control what they think. You can't control what they believe to be true or their ideas. All you have control over is you, and that's all you need control over. It's their life to live, and it's your life to live. So I want to challenge you. I want to encourage you to go live the wish that you really wish you were living. Pardon me. Go live the life that you wish you were living. Go live the dream that you want to make happen. If you have a chance, take it. Go and do it. Take the next step. Go and do something with this because this opportunity of life that you have, that I have, that we've been given, one day isn't going to be there. And we won't have this lifetime anymore. And at the end of all of it, I don't think we're going to be looking back thinking, oh man, did I, please, did I hopefully please enough people? Did I make everybody else happy? No, I think we'll be asking, did I please myself? Did I make myself happy? Was I truly satisfied with the life that I gave? Was I truly satisfied with the efforts that I put forward so that I could become who I wanted to be? So this one fear that holds us back, it's an illusion because we don't even know if it's real, but it feels real to us. And the way to overcome it is realize that it really doesn't matter. What's more important, the life you really want, the life you dream of, or the potential opinion or idea of somebody else? It's great to be with you guys. Keep this in mind as you're progressing through the journey of life and the journey of your dreams.